I'm Paula Deming, reading for Settler number three. We could settle here. We've traveled two lengths of road today. It's the perfect distance. I know you're there, Rob. You can't hide from me. What are you doing? Sneaking in here in the middle of the night, stealing from the stores of grain? You know you don't need to steal from me. I'll give you whatever you want. All you have to do is ask for it. Oh, wait. You like the thrill of the chase. The game, the risk. You'll never be satisfied with anything freely given to you. Well, guess what? I didn't freely give you my heart. I don't want to love you. Yeah, I should love Seamus. Do you know every time he sails into port, he brings me three gifts. All I've ever given him in return is one bundle of wood. Everyone expects me to end up with him. To love him. But I can't. Because you've stolen me. Forget about the grain you've stolen from the other settlers, from the, the ore, the brick, the sheep. You've stolen my heart. And if you asked me, I'd walk down any road with you. The longest road you can think of. Yeah, life on Catan is hard. But that's why I'm glad I have you. You're the best friend a new settler on an island could ever ask for. Well, I don't care what people say, Dolly. I know you're a sheep, but I wouldn't have been able to survive all this without you. Oh, hey, want to trade that sheep for these two chunks of ore that I have? Wait, ore? Yeah, definitely. 